Get your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free. If you work on specific jobs for customers and need to track amounts spent and earned by job, you may want to set your job defaults. To access the job defaults, select Maintain. Default Information – Jobs from the menu bar. To set the general default job settings, click the General tab. To enable warnings if line items are not assigned to jobs, check either or both the For a Customer Transaction and For a Vendor Transaction checkboxes. To set the default job statuses, click the Statuses tab. There are four job statuses provided by default and you can add more if needed. To add a new job status, click the Add New button, select an icon color from the icon drop-down, and then enter a name in the name field. To make it the default job status, check the Use as Default checkbox. Then click the Save button to save it into the Job Status list to the right. To delete a job status from this list, click it to select it, and then click the Delete button. To change its position in the list, click it to select it, and then click the Move Up or Move Down buttons. To create default custom fields for jobs, click the Custom Fields tab. You can create up to five custom fields for jobs. To do this, enter the names of the fields into the Field Labels fields and then check the Enable Check box to the right of the fields. After defining the custom fields here, you can later enter the specific values for each job record. To save the job defaults after changing them, click the OK button in the Job Defaults window. Like what you see? Pick up your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free.